Hey YouTubers, welcome to the channel. I'm Tony the Technician. Today we're gonna to be going into five deals at Northern Tool that I believe are worth looking at or worth considering purchasing. So these are all gonna be items $10 and below. So don't expect anything like fancy, super amazing, but for the price, I think they're great tools and should be considered. Also keep in mind that some of these are items that I wouldn't want to spend a lot of money on because you don't need to. So let's go ahead and get right into this. If you guys haven't been to a Northern Tool, I highly suggest checking it out. It's like your Harbor Freight, plus a lot of the stuff that you would find at like Home Depot and Lowe's when it comes to tools and, and other miscellaneous items. So they do have a great lineup of items and tools. So definitely check them out. But if you haven't been there, they have like their center section, which is like wooden bins where they keep a lot of the cheaper accessories and small single tools and just cheaper items. So that's where you're gonna find a lot of the, the cheaper stuff. So let's go ahead and get into five of them that I would recommend. First up is an eight piece set from Power Torque. It is a 12 millimeter set. It's kind of like those sets that you find in 10 millimeter. They've been around for years and they've expanded into other sizes as well. It started off with a 10 millimeter set, then you can get 12 and 13, 15 and 17, and 19. They have a lot of dedicated sets. Well, this is the 12 millimeter set. It's gonna have four quarter inch drive sockets and four three eighths drive sockets, all in 12 millimeters. And Power Torque is like one of those brands that you would find at like your auto store, any, you know, automotive store that you guys run to, AutoZone or O'Reilly's or whatever it may be. It's kind of like those brands. Uh, so it is a brand that I've used before. So it's not gonna be like your top end brands, but it's a 12 millimeter socket and you're getting eight of them. I wouldn't be afraid to break any of them. Nothing like that. No, they're not gonna be the highest quality, but for $10, I think it's a good deal. So what you're gonna get in quarter inch drive is a shallow, mid-length, and deep well socket, and then you're also gonna get a universal joint. For the 3H drive, it's a little bit different. You're gonna get a shallow and a deep well and a universal, no mid-length, but you are going to get an extra deep socket. So I thought that was kind of cool. All these brands, kind of, most of them are basically the same. This one is a little bit different. No impact sockets are included, but you do get an extra deep 12 millimeter socket. So I thought that was a pretty good deal for $10. Next up is a product from a company called Grip, which I actually have used quite a few of their products. Uh, they, they're definitely just kind of like Power Torque, one of your cheaper brands, or they make cheaper items. I have like their automotive Q-tip set. I don't know what you want to call it, but like you have a variety of different Q-tips, which are really handy for cleaning. Um, but I also have their hammer set from, I don't know, six, seven years ago that I paid like $40 for the five or six piece set. Fantastic. They no longer sell it as a set. You can buy them individually, but they've actually held up really well and great for DIYers or, you know, weekend warriors. But today we're looking at their 24 piece mini clamp set. So you're gonna get two three inch clamps and 22 two inch clamps. And once again, this is just kind of one of those little accessory things that you can pick up just to be handy for many different situations. Hanging things, holding things, trash can bags or liners, whatever. They can just be really handy. And they're also $7, so they come in a nice little you know, plastic container and they can just be handy to have around just in case you need to hold something in place or anything like that. So if you guys are enjoying this content, please make sure to hit that thumbs up. And if you guys haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. But let's go ahead and get into the next item. Next up is a five inch auto punch. This is from the brand Ironton or Iron Ton, whatever you want to call it. But once again, this is another tool that I wouldn't want to spend a whole lot of money on. Now, if you're using one of these tools on a daily basis, yeah, you might go with something a little bit more expensive, a little bit higher quality. But if you're just drilling uh, starting holes, you know, every once in a while, this is gonna work just fine for you. I have a cheap one and it's worked just fine over the last five years that I've had it and uh, I can't complain about it. They're spring-loaded center punches and you simply just push down on it to, you know, create a dimple in order to start drilling just a little bit easier and to make sure that you're centered wherever you need to be. So it's just a handy tool to have around, plus it's $5, so you can't really beat that. It's extremely affordable and a very simple yet helpful tool. 
And I do want to mention that it also has adjustable tension so you can adjust how easy it is to basically make that impact when you push down on it, which is going to create either a lighter or a harder dimple in whatever material you're working with. And then next up is another product that once again, I would not want to spend a whole lot of money on. If you go to Harbor Freight, you can get a lot of those magnetic trays for free, sometimes a dollar or two. Well, this one's a little bit beyond that, kind of a nice little uh, magnetic tray, and it's you know a little bit different than just your standard round or square tray. This is a product from Grip, once again, and it is an eight inch magnetic tray, but it has a magnetic center section, and then it has a plastic surround with other dividers in it, in order to hold you know different types of tools but the center section i believe is the only magnetic part and then the rest is just kind of like a, a plastic divider so kind of nice sometimes it can be annoying if you have things in the magnetic part so it is nice to have the magnetic portion and the non-magnetic portion yet you can still put this on any magnetic surface the center tray is going to be a stainless steel and then the outer divider portions are going to be an abs plastic and there are gonna be six outer divided portions and then the one center magnetic one. And these are just great for, you know, holding, you know, miscellaneous screws and fasteners and small tools and things like that. And it's gonna cost $8.50, so still quite affordable. And then last up is another grip product. Keep in mind that there are many, many items at Northern Tool in these wooden bins, if that's what you wanna call it. Uh, many, many items. Some of them I wouldn't even bother, some of them slightly overpriced for what they are, but there are usually some pretty good deals in there. And these are some of them that I think are good deals. This last one, I included it because I kind of wanted to get your guys' thoughts on it. I thought it was kind of nifty, but at the same time, maybe not really necessary. I'm not sure. Let me know your guys' thoughts. Would you guys use it? That being the grip magnetic clip. So it's basically like if you were to take a magnetic tray, but you've removed the tray and you have this magnetic platform basically clip onto your shirt or clip onto your pants or clip onto whatever you're working on, whether that be a ladder or whatnot. I thought it was kind of, I was kind of interested in it, but then again, would you guys get use out of something like this? It has three magnets built into it. So I think in certain situations it can definitely be handy. So that's why I wanted to get your guys' thoughts on the product. But once again, this one is also $2, so it is extremely affordable and, uh, Figured I would at least throw this one in there as a mention. So those are the five items for today underneath $10 at Northern Tool that I believe are good deals. Stay tuned for the next video where we go over some great deals at $25 or under. And then I have some other deals that I'm gonna throw in at the end of that video that you need to keep an eye out for because you can get some fantastic deals on some really good quality products. So stay tuned for that video. It's gonna be a little bit more interesting, I believe, than this one, just because this one is a, your more affordable items that you probably shouldn't be spending a lot of money on. So I really hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys did, please make sure to hit that thumbs up. Leave a comment down below of your guys' thoughts on some of these products. And as always, if you haven't subscribed, please consider subscribing. I'll see you guys next time.